Hey what's up guys you are watching for tech so from the last few months i have been using the cyberia os android 12 rom for my oneplus 6 and waiting for another rom to test finally the god of all roms pixel experience is available for our device so today in this video i will quickly show you the installation and review of the rom this process will wipe your storage so keep the data and the twrp in android backup of previous rom which you are using so you can revert back at any stage so without wasting your time let's get started on the new adventure before flashing you must be on the twrp 3.6 installed on your phone i assume that most of you coming from the cyber OS, so you are already on the twrp and having the option oc 1.1 firmware on the both the slots so download all the files given under the video description like pixel explain zip, finalize zip, disable dm for ITC. Now remove all pin passwords under the security setting. Now reboot phone to retrieve WRP 3.6 using the advanced reboot. If you didn't have this recovery, image file is given under the video description. You can boot to TWRP 3.6 using fastboot commands and install it as a permanent recovery under the advanced option. Now tap install select the pixel explain zip file. Flash the file, after flashing, tap add once and then tap install current TWRP or you can also flash the TWRP installer via installation process. Now reboot back to the TWRP again. Now tap install and select the finalize zip and flash it. Then flash the DM variety zip. Now go to the format data, type yes, click reboot to the system. The phone will boot to the beautiful pixel experience ROM boot logo. Do the complete setup, ROM has all the Pixel device features like the original Google Pixel device. It has Pixel launcher with the, all the features. So let's jump under the settings, about phone. So here we are upgraded to Android 12 based Pixel experience ROM. This is the latest bit of 4th February 2022. This is the beautiful star egg of Android 12. So let's see what's working and we'll check any bugs are there in the ROM or not. So the Wi-Fi and Wi-Fi are sort of working well. So the main question is OLT. So the OLT is working perfectly. We can do the OLT voice calls and also we can receive the OLT incoming calls too without any issues. Auto brightness working very good. Alert slider is also working but I will also show you how to configure it for the different activities later in the video. Fingerprint sensor is working. We can configure multiple fingerprints and they are working very good and fast. NFC is available and functional, Bluetooth is working, connecting to the Bluetooth devices and the voice is also working in the Bluetooth devices without any issues. Audio in the speaker is loud enough and here is a sample. Auto enable change driving mode in any OnePlus device, that method works for many OnePlus phone except OnePlus Nord 2. So ROM didn't come with any camera application, I have given the link of stable Google Cam in the video description, download and install it. Surprisingly, camera having the very good picture quality as a stock of the noise camera. It has bunch of the options like the night side, portrait, slow motion, time lapse, and all are working fine. So let's check the Pixel device's unique feature that comes with the ROM. So the ROM has fully working monet theming under the styles and wallpaper settings. With every new wallpaper, whole look of the device get changes to the another level. We also get the dark theme and theme icon tab in the same setting. If you go to the settings and then system, we get the pixel exclusive live translate tab. The other setting is to pick the Android 12 navigation bar is available. One handed mode by swiping down and up or the navigation gesture bar. We can also change it to access the notification panel instead of one handed mode. So here is the additional button setting for the alert slider. Here we can assign the different activities like the vibration silent total silence to the each position of our slider as per our wish. Unlimited media backup is available in the photo app. Overall performance of the ROM is very snappy. I didn't face any lag anywhere but still I done the gig base test. It gives me score of 1924 for the multi core and 496 for the single core which is less than the average results of the gig bench. But still ROM is performing decent so no worry. Battery life is didn't test at 8 but as per my opinion it will last long as a Cybera ROM that battery test video given in a right side card. 
so definitely flash this rom if you are a fan of pixel phones to feel the real pixel phone in your hand so that's it for today guys if you think i help you please do like and share this video subscribe our channel press the bell icon for the notification of our upcoming content thanks for watching see you next time bye bye